Hey folks, Species7 here, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to Farm Sim 19 Really glad you could all join me here today, I hope you enjoy the episode. I am dragging behind me a modded version of the Joskin Aquatrans. And, uh, it's been modded in so much as it will allow either milk or water. And, well, you guys have seen me back up dolly trailers, and, uh, even saying back up dolly trailers kind of makes a liar out of me, because I can't back them up. All I can do is push them around in some random direction. And having this thing means I will not have to do that. Now, unfortunately, like the in-game trailers, it, for some odd reason, they don't seem to, uh, have left us the ability to empty a trailer anymore. Like, if I decide that, ah, darn, all the water didn't fit in the cow pen and I need to pick up milk, yeah, I can't just, uh, you know, go to some quiet corner and go, well, let's just dump this water. You can't. Which is unfortunate. I think that's, uh, you know, at least as far as water goes, I don't really see why they would be, uh, you know, not thinking it's a good a plan. So, let's start filling her up. Because as you can see... Dun, 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 dun. We're in the cows. So I thought I'd try them all. Well, not the, the Brahmas. As I don't think they'd quite find this northern... Sorry. This northern climb to be of their liking. But we got your uh, standard black and white cows. And we got some brown and white cows. We got some black cows. We got some brown cows. We have no white cows, which, considering there's brown and white, and there's black and white, and there's black and there's brown, makes you wonder what they got against white. Oh well. There we go. We have uh, we have cows. So even though we can't, ooh, boy, that triggers. Uh, she's up there, eh? Ah well. Let's. Uh, I know. I feel bad now. He's sitting there sniffing the empty trough. Poor cow. Alright, there's our 7,300 liters of water. All we need to do is figure out what we're going to do with it now that we have it. Alrighty. Okay, these are obviously feed me troughs and not water me troughs, right? Right. This is the... There it is. I didn't say, that's the buy me cow thing. So... There we are. Hey, ladies. Have you some water? Now, I do want to try piggies on the map. And I am going to be getting a horse. I want all of the animals. Wow! Woo! Well, well. The thirsty cow, huh? How are you doing then? Uh, hmm. They'd take another two of those trailers if they had anything to say about it. Wow. Hmm. So you have five of each. So we have uh, 20 cows. Wow. You guys drank all that water. Well, you took all that water. You didn't drink it all, obviously. Thankfully. Hmm. Alright, well, it's probably good for the moment, anyway. So, let's go find us a place to stick a voo this. Do do do. Hmm, where's a good spot? This is getting, uh, filled up rather crickery, in it? Rather quickly, indeed. I think what I'm gonna do... Let's take advantage of this backspace here.
There we go. It's not a bad spot, eh? Click. Alright, how's Mr. Hired Worker doing? Hmm. That's, uh, pretty impressive. Well, he's either stuck in a tree, or he's done. Oh, we'll have to wee patch there, eh, mate? He's... Apparently. Alright. Hmm. Come on, big monster, let's go. But not bad. Not bad. That may have a lot to do with where I actually started him as well. Well, we're not going to get all of that one on this go. That's alright. Let's get this little bit done. Okay. Even this big fent finds dragging that thing around a little bit of a an issue. It does it just fine, mind you, but... She's letting you know it's taking all the bananas it's got. Okay, grab this last bit. Yeah, not too shabby at all. These fields are uh, certainly beyond the capabilities of any AI that we saw in uh, 17 or 15, that's for sure. Now, why were you missed? Are you just a little hole in the middle of nowhere? Oh, apparently not. Okay, that, I think, should be a wrap. Yep. Alright, see, even these little weird, edgy corner... Oh, look at that, eh? Darn. I only managed to get all of I did one headland all the way around, and that was about it. The rest of it I turned over to the AI, so... Wee. Okay. Well, let's grab our friend here, a cedar. Let's get our up. Well, that was just brilliant species. Come on now. <laughs> yes. Alright, let's, uh... <laughs> I'm sorry, excuse me. No. There we are. Grass. Perfect. Let's, uh... <laughs> Uh, 
let's just tuck you out of here for a moment, shall we? There we go. Close enough. Unfolded, get around the side. I didn't knock it over this time. Woohoo! <laughs> Alright. And with that, let's uh, drop her down. Let's crank her on. And let's go be grass sowers. I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to give her one ring around the rosy here. And then we will turn it over to the uh, apparently reasonably capable hired help. So, we'll see how that goes. And soon enough, we shall have a meadow. Indeed. And thanks to my buddy Delirious for pointing out that there is a meadow on the map that's pretty decent. However, as I plan to uh, cook through a fair bit of critters, and I don't actually mean cook through, of course, but, um, yeah. I would like to have a, a good supply of grass very close to me. So, hence the, uh, this whole deal. We certainly have enough fields that we can manage to keep the rest of the crops in line. You know, a little bit of oat for the horses, and that sort of thing. But, you know, maybe some soybeans so we can get into some pigs. And we'll have to see. I haven't quite figured out where I would put pigs. But, uh, oh, wow, look at that. That's not good. I missed an entire section. Ha. Huh. Now the question is... Has this thing got enough of a cultivator built into it? Or do I need to go and take out that tool one more time? She's not having trouble with this angle. I don't know why. It's a nice smooth circle. I just seem to be oversteering the heck out of it. There we go. Well, I guess besides my little ring around here, I better check and see if this thing will actually chew through there or not. I mean, it certainly seems to have enough discs and such on it that it should, uh... Oh, but that's counting as plowing, so... Yeah, I'm gonna, uh... I'm gonna go deal with that. So I am. Yep, 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 yep. Because, <laughs> yeah, this is also counting as my, uh, my first plowing of the field. So, let's get her done up proper, shall we? whiteness okay this is going to require a little bit of oh well I'm probably going to end up popping up a bit of the seed that I just put in but oh I keep forgetting that extra layer alright 
see how we do here. Try not to tear up too much of it. That's flat out, by the way. You can see the difference in the power between those two tractors, hey? <laughs> Oh, come on, little JCB, you can do her. <laughs> wow. Uh. He's going mad with a way to end my day. Uh. Uh. Struggle on, little yellow tractor. There you go. <laughs> all right, didn't like that all a lot. But there it is, it's done. Proper and right. Ah, oh, really? I knocked the sign over. Uh oh. Oh man. Kind of miss that on the multiplayer, though. <laughs> All the signs you can actually drive right through them. Not the telephone poles, though. By guppy. Some of those are some solid, I'll tell you. All right. Now. That should do it. Much better. Much, much better. Okay, Sprinty. Oh, there's a good place to park you. Let's be all tricky. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be an issue, isn't it? Nope. Cool. And... Let's run really fast back to our other tractor. Yeah, I know, I have that player speed thing on. I could run across the map in about 11 seconds, but that's all right. I'm not really fun of or a fan of the Muppet racing. Okay. Oopsie. Thank you. Now... Let's get ourselves lined up, shall we? Right, let's let's get ourselves lined up at the very last set. That should do it. I think I might have gone a little bit wide there. Oh well, we can come back and fix that quickly enough. Now he's going to drive all the way up there. Beautiful. Thinking, thinking, thinking he's going to drive into the river and just end it all. <laughs> all right. See, now this isn't an easy thing to figure out because let's face it, you've got to start here. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. All right, we will let uh, the Grassmaster there carry on. Now. Lovely. What's Manitou? All right. Uh -huh. Up we go. I hear ya. Whew. I forgot how.
how quickly this thing turns. It's all about the agility. Alright, once... Uh, There they are. I thought I left myself some bales. Now, I haven't tried this particular bale port before. This is from the Mod Hub. Okay, standard stuff there. Ah. Whee! Grump! Let's see. Oh, look at that. It's not terribly convenient. There we go. Okay. So I guess the idea here is, is it can actually uh, drop a little bit of bale, hey? Alright, let's see how we do. I only want the one, actually, so maybe. Then you must ask yourself. Ah, <laughs> uh, there it is. Okie dokie. I wasn't sure where they uh, were expecting us to put this, but apparently it's just up here, I think. I wonder if I have to use a blower. Cows are watching me very warily, going, I don't think he knows what he's doing. I wonder if they knew how right they are. There we go. Alright. New plan. New plan. That's probably not a good idea, eh? There we go. Just take some of the pressure off the hydraulics. Have them holding a 4,000 liter bale up in the air like that. Okay, this has got to be where that goes. So, hmm. Alright, doing an awesome job. Meanwhile, whoa. <laughs> Dang, this thing is fast. Which is, of course, one of the reasons we all use the JCBs. You can cover that distance. Whoa, oh, bam, oh, man. That was a bit of a nasty, eh? A little bit of a jump at the top of that hill. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> oh, yay, 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 yay. 
come on. Yeah, they're fast, but I don't find them to be that torquey for the amount of horsepower in them. You know? Alright, now... I think this time... Yeah, let's go this way. I think it might be a little quicker. missed our turn off. There we go. <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty map, you know. There is definitely a few issues with it. And uh, hopefully the map author is going to show it some love and fix them up. Or maybe, as my friend Driz says, that what he's done is thrown down a really, really good base, and uh, as the mods become available, the map will uh, improve and increase. And I'm hoping it does, because I'm kind of liking this. Another little jump, but that one was on a straight, so we were okay. Alright, how are we doing here? Oh, we got lots of gas. We don't need to stop here yet. And I've already bought the item we're coming here for, so... Let's just pick it up and get the heck out of here. There it is. Our wagon of mixing. Yes, indeed. Isn't that a pretty thing? Well, you ain't gonna be all white inside for long, I'll tell you. Okay, everything's attached. Good, let's get out of here. Yeah, see, even with barely any rise, you can really see the difference in this tractor. Now, we do have that uh, fill mass weight thing, whatever the heck that is, that mod. So, of course, things are going to be a little heavier than Giants had scripted them. But, that's okay. We'll, uh, we'll really get to test her here in a moment. Alright, flat out. Boom. Ooh, that's one of those ones that shrinks your spine by about an eighth of an inch. <laughs> okay. Oh, we've lost 10k. This thing's empty. Imagine full, we'd be doing a heck of a lot worse, wouldn't we? Well, that's not bad. Slowly still losing a little bit. Mm. Alrighty. Now. There's a lot of traffic on this map. A lot of traffic. How's that side? Pretty good, eh? We'll let this guy pass. And the guy behind him. Still looking good? It's still looking okay. Let's go. <coughs> oh, goodness. Well, that'll clear the head. <laughs> I'm hoping this thing's going to let me use it just like a straight blower. There's no reason it shouldn't. I hope. Here's our turn. Exceeding our speed by one, briefly. A 
Yeah, you don't need a whole lot of throttle to get down this hill. I was watching Driz was showing the, uh... What the heck is it? Uh, engine brake mod? Where it basically, uh... Well, I guess for the moment at least, what it seems to do is completely remove your engine brake. So you can get up to speed, take your finger off the trigger, and if you're on level ground, you just keep going. You basically coast darn near forever. Pretty cool. But, with the way I drive, any extra braking help I can get is probably a good thing. Uh, let's take her up this way. There we go. Um, hmm. Can I actually? Yeah, I can. Sure I can. Sure I can. I can get through here. There we go. Loverly. There we are. Woo! I don't think we need quite that much arm on her. Nice. Alrighty. Well, I noticed one thing right away. We're backwards. But yeah, this is uh, this is the way it needs done. So, um, and dang it, the outlet's on the other side. So let's uh, let's move Jiminy Cricket out of the way here. I love that. This thing can turn around in its own length. <laughs> perfect spot for you. Yeah, I believe this is the uh, spit me out shoot here, so let's uh, let's get this sorted. There we are. Get you turned around. There we are, and back up the hill. It'd be nice if that was a little closer, but that's okay. There we are. How's that looking? Eh? Good. Good, good, good. They have something at least, eh? Nice. Very nice. And did that actually even put a dent in them or what? Nah, they could use a couple more. So they're good, clean, they got water. Obviously it's food that we need. We're only at 20% effectiveness here. So... Hmm... But I don't think I'm going to uh, go and buy the other bales at this time. I mean, we are creating a meadow. We do have, uh, you know, the ability to make all our own stuff, basically. Now, I don't believe that we have a functional silage pit here, do we? I don't believe we do. So 
I was kind of hoping this was, but as you can see, it doesn't doesn't actually fit the bill. So all right, these guys would be more for root crop and such. Yeah, I don't think it's something, unfortunately, that we actually have. No, nope. didn't think so. Is there a weight sitting in there? There is two, eh? <laughs> cool. Guess we have uh, one more tractor bit than I thought. Yeah, I'd have to, uh, oh, wait a minute. Could it be? Could it be? No. Eh? Darn. Just storage again. Alright, so there is no silage bunker, as it were. I don't imagine for a minute adding one would be sort of easy. Nice if you just stick a small one there, but... Alright, so I have two choices at this point, I guess. We can either find a place for a pit, and I'm still actually quite quite fearful, <laughs> to put it bluntly, of uh, placeable silage pits. So I think what I'm going to have to do, likely, is... Um do what I'm doing on the multiplayer map and get the uh, get the baler wrapper that produces the round bales and use that for our grass and silage um, hmm yeah probably a better bet I think what I'm gonna do here likely in fact yeah we will do that I'm gonna take the baler that uh, we purchased the square baler No, we get lots of money. You know what? I'm just going to buy the other one. But I'm not going to drag you guys back to the shop. I think that's going to have to do her for this episode. Again, really, really, really thankful that everybody showed up to give this a watch. It's always appreciated. Have yourselves a wonderful day. And, uh, oh, that was close. We will, uh, we'll catch you here next time. Take care of each other, folks. And ciao for now.